graduated, what advice would you give yourself before starting out? Right. Try not to get pre pregnant the year of your graduation. <laughs> that could be tough. <laughs> um, do take up opportunities that come. I feel that I, mm, I think I made it harder for myself um, by thinking that you know there was an opportunity around every corner. Um, so and I would I think I was working more collectives now. I think I gather together my few artist friends mm -hmm. and say let's do this let's do that because that you know they're the people that ultimately will um help you 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 are you're stronger as a group and you, you even if it's as we were saying it's just that you're getting shows together or something i think i would have gone into that much more than i did so i was a bit i felt a bit isolated i became very isolated and then as a mother i became quite out isolated um, I was a single parent as well, and so it was all quite a journey. But I think I think that would be that would be very important. Yeah, any opportunity, grab it, and uh, opportunities to work in a collective. I think um, they're the best, and you know they'll get your work out there because because my work, the opportunities I've had have come from me being in a um, a mixed show and. In other parts of the country, mm. you know, don't London isn't the only place <laughs> in the world. <laughs> so get out there, yeah. you know. I mean, the, I had a solo show in Grimsley, which was which was great, and people were coming to chat to me, and I ran a few workshops there, and it was just so nice that they were really appreciative of work, you know. Which sometimes you show in London, and people won't even come and talk to you. you know, <laughs> it's like everyone everyone looks very good. <laughs> it's like you come and talk to me. <laughs> yeah, so, <clears throat> yeah, any opportunity, anywhere around England or Europe, anywhere mm. that you can show, yeah, that's what I would say. And what advice would you give to uh, somebody who's completely new to the art world, just stepping into it right now? Or just finishing college or just starting college? It could be, it could be anything. It, it mm. could be... Uh, a late balloonal friend, or it could be a young person just leaving, starting, just starting out in the art world right now. Um, I would say be true to yourself, and that can be hard because you get swayed along, you know, about oh, if you did this, that would sell, or mm, this is fashionable now. You know, decide what you want from it. If it, I think that's important. You know, do you want to become a curator? What kind of art do you want to deal with? Do you want to deal with um, living room art? You know, what art that fits in with interior decor, which is fine, but be clear as to what you want to deal with and just stay true to it, I would say. Just stay true to yourself.